I continue to be amazed with just the basic anatomy and design of the Bluefin tuna. It's just spectacular. Let's just start here at the head area. If you look at its eyes, its eyes are perfectly flush with it, smooth. It actually has, you can't see it very well, but it has a tongue and small teeth. And so it just swallows basically whatever its feet is whole. But you got your gill plate right here that protects your gills. And this thing is really like a plate. I mean, it's called a plate, it's a gill plate. But what's so fascinating is just the basic design of its body allows everything to almost recess into it. So this is your pectoral fin right here. Notice you got a slot. So it will slide into this slot perfectly so that it's aerodynamic in the water. And this is why this is such a beast in the ocean. And then if you go to the top here, you can't even nest right now, you can't see, but there's a dorsal fin that is hiding inside of the tuna. So I actually have to dig it out and then bam, there's your dorsal fin that comes out. So that's your primary dorsal fin. Recesses completely inside of the tuna. And this is your second dorsal fin right here. Comes in and out just like that. You've got an anal fin here as well in the bottom of the fish. And then what's fascinating is you've got these, all these small fins, these are called finlets, finlets. And so they can move contrary to each other. And this is why it's flying in the water. And then finally, you've got your cardinal fin. And what's wild is this like, the muscle, this is all muscle that you see right here with this fish. It's so powerful. I mean, if you try to hold on to this tail while it was moving it, I mean, it would just break your wrist. So this is also known as the fin fork. It looks like a fork, but this is why bluefin tuna is, and this is the tuna family in general, is such an exceptional, uh, beautiful animal. And so hopefully now you know a little bit more about the amazing Bluefin tuna.